Greetings from Willie Tees. Do you want to scale your t-shirt business by adding long sleeve tees to your apparel line? Check out how we do it and get some tips and tricks on how to make your t-shirt business successful. After taking the extra moisture out of the shirt with your pre-press, you can add your t-shirt tags. After your first press of the tag, remove the transfer paper. Now you're ready to press with craft paper to lock in the design. Now that you've locked in that tag, now for the next step, sleeves. There's many ways to do a sleeve design, but for this project, we're going to go three inches from the shoulder. That way it's right in the middle. All right, let's take off that transfer paper and add some craft paper to the next press to bring out the color. I wanted to add that when you're doing your pre-press, you want to press those sleeves out too. That way you'll have a good guideline so you can middle all of your prints that are on your sleeves. On the other sleeve, we're going to press our logo. And we usually like to use a pillow to make sure that everything lays flat. Now we lock in that design and bring out the colors with craft paper. We finish both sleeves. Now let's go to the front. You want to center your design according to the center of the neckline. And your print should start three inches or four fingers down from the neckline. After pressing for 15 to 20 seconds, let's take that transfer paper off. And when you have bright colors that you're working with, you want to make sure you're using that craft paper. And now you have a fully customized tee, sleeves, front, and t-shirt tag. And we usually give it a final press before shipping so it can stay crispy. And this is the final product. Please leave all questions in the comment section and please follow and like if you like this type of daily content. This is Willie Tease. Get your swag on.